Officer Goodman passes Senator Mitt Romney and directs him to turn around in order to get to safety. I swore an oath and to protect the public, the member of Congress, and the United States Constitution. And, I, and that's what I was doing that, that day. What were you fighting for that day? Democracy. It was for democracy. It was for men and women of the House and Senate. It was for each other. And it was for the future of the country. In situations like that, I kind of reverted to ranger mode, which was uh, just focusing on what I could do to actually try to uh, get us out of that. So I went around and started locking and making sure the doors were locked and closed, uh, moving some of the other members away from the doors, uh, directed the other members to remove their pins so that they weren't identifiable in case the mob did break through. Uh, I had a pin in my pocket that I could use as a weapon. I was looking for other uh, weapons as well. And then I was coordinating with the Capitol Police to try to find uh, a way out for us. Glass shattering, an angry mob trying to break down the doors. Arizona Representative Ruben Gallego says he instantly switched from Representative Gallego to Corporal Gallego. His military training kicked in as he stood on top of a chair, yelling out instructions to everyone in the room, guiding them to nearest exits, helping some of his frightened colleagues put on gas masks. disrespected on that day and I tried to do my best to fix it and, and part of that was about casting my vote to certify the Electoral College but it was also about getting the capital back to the condition that it deserves to be in to be a caretaker. 